So here we are. Welcome to Cherrywood. When you first walk in, you want everyone to be bowled over with color. And I'm just going to start right here with our sign. And this is kind of our purple corner. Prints and all of the challenge fabric and books and all of our bundles that have purple in it. And we have these custom made little shelves that hold all of our bundles. The yard size bundles are on top. Half yard bundles. And then the fat quarter bundles. And these are our eight step gradations. So there's eight colors in the bundle. And here we've put, this is some of our softer colors. This is the Bob Ross collection from the Bob Ross Challenge. And then we've got Onyx to Light. We call our black Onyx. Great neutrals with all of our grays. This is the best way to get all of our grays. Tuxedo. That's one of our newer ones and it's a great masculine quilt. We have a pattern called In and Out that it just looks perfect in. Or Googly would be another great pattern for it. This is our Potter's Wheel collection. This is our lightest, lightest collection. Eight colors of just very, barely their color. And this is our darkest one. This collection is called Midnight Garden. Real rich colors. The darker the color, the more suede texture you're going to see. So I really love this one. And our chestnut to light. This chestnut is the first step. And then they get lighter and lighter and lighter. So we call it chestnut to light. Here is our reminder that the Diana Cherrywood Challenge is still going on. It has been extended until the end of the year since this has been such a interesting year. We are extending the deadline. So there's the beautiful four colors that you get in the packet. And all you have to do is make a small quilt 20 inches square and come up with a original design something that reminds you of Diana or something that inspired you about Diana and we have lots of entries that have come in already but now you've got more time now this little display is just a, a quick overview for when you first stop in the store you can see all of the patterns that we carry or most of the patterns these you can get in the kits as you see them the samples that we make up we also have clothing patterns Over here we have our four steps and up there we've got Wicked. That was what started the Cherrywood Challenge. Wicked was the first one inspired by the Broadway musical. And we've got 
grass medley, pink medley, plum medley, violet medley, turquoise medley. This is the bundle from Van Gogh. A little bit different turquoise and then it's put with more royal blue. There you see it in the yard size bundle, which is much more fun. Much more fun to pick up and fondle. Here's our teal medley. This is one of our best selling four steps. I think we just hit on just the right combination of blue green. Then we have the Prince collection that we saw earlier. These were the purples that were used in that glorious collection. Then we have Hot Medley. It's a collection of four. Kind of lipstick colors. I almost named this one lipstick. Um, just because I thought they were all great colors. Even the orange, I've seen orange lipstick. Hot and spicy. And that leads us to the orange medley. Again, just going, um, the darkest color just gets lighter and lighter. So great background um, for our applique. Here's our zest. Kind of lemony yellow to a light orange. And this is the Lion King collection. That was our second challenge. And we use the rich, earthy, golden colors. And then this is our beige medley. So I wanted to point out that the violet medley and the hot medley and zest were all designed to go together. So those colors change and gradually gradate and now you've got a expanded version for a larger project. So that's what I really love about four steps they're smaller collections that are easy easy to build together and make your own color palette. Add it on to a, an eight step. And then below you, you'll see lots of the kits that are already made up and ready to pick up and take home with you. This is one of my newer patterns, Petal Palette. Here's the round and round Christmas wreath that we showed in our Christmas show. Great little gift in time for Christmas. And of course, chill is the newest pattern in our Buffalo check plaid background. Here is the actual petal palette quilt. And all of its Glory. This is using our color wheel gradations. We have 12 step color wheel in light, medium, dark. And I designed this pattern to show that off and it creates a stunning quilt. Blue quilt is our serenity. It's kind of folded up but the word serenity is raw edge fused onto a background of simple nine patches. And the nine patches change in color and gradate and get darker towards the bottom, creating a beautiful background for hot air balloons. And even more eight-step gradations. 
All of these are available in the three sizes of bundles. Full yard, half yard, fat quarter. We've got our greens grouped together. Forest floor. Meadow. Kiwi berry. This is Texas Ranch. Madagascar, one of our top sellers. Blue Lagoon, we've had this one for a while. This is Tropicana. This is Arizona, one of our soft dusty kind of colorways. This is Copenhagen. Dusty blue down to a dusty, um, kind of a paprika color. This is our antique rose. Our tequila sunrise, which is similar, but a little more peachy than this one, which is Dutch tulip. Isn't that beautiful? I just love being in here and being surrounded by all this color. And on the barn door here, we have our Jane Sassaman quilt hanging. Pretty proud of this. Jane designed this especially for cherry wood. I'm gonna close this barn door so we can get a close up of her beautiful stitching. She has a wonderful method of applique and finishing with decorative stitching, sometimes hand stitching. And she designed this pattern exclusively for cherry wood. It's actually, it's called the table runner, but I just love it on the wall. It's very long, very striking. Oh, I almost missed our yardage. This is our bookcase of yardage colors. Um, they are larger pieces. They're in the two yard pieces that we start with. And we have 40 different colors that you can order in this size or smaller, meaning a two yard piece or a one yard piece. So if you need a three yard piece, we would give you two pieces from the same dye lot. Um, we have discovered that a two yards works best in the way that we dye and do the suede texture. So we are sticking to that. <laughs> 